of 1% of Americans are serving. And so what that means is many Americans cannot grasp the reality of war. I can talk statistics to you all night long, but it doesn't matter to me if we're not doing something about it. Do you agree with that? Yes. It is incumbent upon every single person in this room when you leave this event from here on out, it is incumbent on all of you to wake up every day and every day that you draw breath, earn it. Live a life worthy of their great sacrifice. Us regular folks in the United States, we, we just don't realize the magnitude of what our veterans really give. Um, for those that, that give their ultimate sacrifice, we can somewhat understand, but for those that come back um, maimed or injured um, and, uh, and the memories that they, they have, uh, we, just, we just don't get that. I want you to start bidding on some of those silent auction items, thinking about every bid that you do, every shirt that you do is to save lives, because we want to put as many service dogs as possible in the hands of service members. And we can do it, folks. America can step up. Thank you for joining us, Joey. First Marine Division Vietnam veteran. Among other individual awards, he received the Combat Action Ribbon and Vietnam Cross of Gallantry with Combat B. You see, Joey's been on a list with Custom Canines waiting on a sponsor to come and pay for that dog that could be yours. And I think that there's one you've been hoping for and maybe working with, and that puppy's name is Olive. Guess what? This great group of people, we raised enough money tonight, y'all. We're going to give this Vietnam veteran a service dog. I am just so blessed. I just thank God. And I thank my wife for putting up with me all these years. But this means the world to see a lot of these people just appreciate all of us. Veterans, you know, it, it, it's just, I don't know. <laughs> I, I'm, I'm speechless.